The lunatic is on the grass. Hi, it's Linda here, and I've been going down this rabbit hole of um, UN Agenda 21, and I think they call it something different now because I can't find really the um, 2013 one. Um, <clears throat> I know we call Amer uh, UN Agenda 21 now America 2050, and Russia calls theirs Russia 2045. However, um, I did go down a little rabbit hole here. And I'm wondering if these wars are not just for depopulation because of who signed on to Eugenda 21. And um, this would be of 2012. And now I'll show you, and I'll show you some other things too. I'll try to do this quickly. Hold on, I don't have screencast. Okay. Now, let's go over here to. Um, wherever I was um, alright right here alright this is a United Nations website right I'm not gonna be able to get on it um, I, I will put the link to the United Nations website on and when you get on there uh, shoot wish I had it pulled up you um, you go to the maps and you see peace keeping operations um, this is what it's going to look like it's horrible um, I mean they've got something for every part of the world um, now um, also I wanted to show you this these are the members of Eugenda, uh, UN Agenda 21 as of March 2012 um, and if we go down here right here if you pick a letter you can like we'll go to I and it'll show you that well it you can just scroll down the eyes it'll show you who's on there we've got Iran Israel Iraq Italy now um, I also wanted to see Korea North and South Korea right there right there North and South Korea. Uh oh, that's when their time is. Let me try to go back here. Okay. Um, the the people you think weren't on here, they're on here, and that disturbed me, including Syria. Uh, right here, right there, Syria. And so what this got me to thinking. Ah, uh, Yemen. Um, th what what this got me to thinking is um. Maybe these wars are or are, are, are theater for um, us just for a depopulation thing. I mean, this was in 1992. Who George W. Bush Sr. did this, and and the same a lot of the same countries are signed on. It'll go down and show you all the countries here that are on it. And I'm going to leave these links. Um, let's see. Oh, this one tells you the populations. You have to scroll down here and look at what they want the populations to be. And I'm going to leave this link. This got scary um, of how they want to do this. I'll also find the one that is... Um, that's the maps. I will also... Here's, uh, oh, here's the United Nations website. Okay, and it says, We the people, a stronger UN for a better world, and I would put order on there. And I had scrolled down here just to maps to get me to the map site. So I, I will leave this for you. And um, I'm going to go outside. It's a beautiful day, and I need to just, because of what happened in Syria, I don't know if this is just, at some points I wonder, is this is this just a UN mission to depopulate and um, they'll use the theater of war and kill as many as possible yet the supreme leaders of each land get to live at this point I don't know but I do know this most of the human race is good most of us are I would say 90 percent of us are very very good people we, and we need to stand up against this this is awful. 
Um, they don't have the right to decide what you and I should do or have or take our land from us. I've already went through it once with this UN Agenda 21. Um, I'll also put the link up to America 2050. And you guys, you have a nice day. And, and remember, the rest of the human race is good too. Just like you're good, I'm good. It's the elite that are controlling a few, making this an awful world. And it's all of our earth, so remember that. And however you pray, pray for those who are now being destroyed and their families are being torn apart. And and we need, we need to send them some love. And I, I think you need to leave your religion out of it because they're human beings. We share this earth. We are connected. We really are. We're all connected. Peace, love, no fear. And we're going to win this.